the 6th Global Sankalp Unconvention Summit 2014 brought together delegates from across the world to Mumbai. The summit witnessed participation from entrepreneurs, practitioners and investors who play key roles in the business-led development ecosystem. The stage was set for building a global dialogue on inclusive development with a focus on enterprise, capital and inclusive business. Sankalp means pledge or determination in Hindi. It is nothing but a call to action. 24 finalists were selected from 170 applications that vied for the Sankalp Awards. The finalists joined the winning enterprises of Sankalp Africa Summit and delivered elevator pitches and discussed their business models with them. Even if our product is scaled nationwide, it's going to save the country 20,000 crores plus a year, which is almost 4 billion US dollars which is more than enough money to fund every business which fits today and pay for the account deficit of the country. That is the impact which is possible with the solutions we are working on. 17 due diligence commitments were made. 170 plus investor connections were facilitated and award money of more than 90,000 US dollars was dispersed. Jury members announced sector winners across agriculture, food and livelihoods, clean energy and clean technology, education and vocational training, technology for development and financial inclusion, the Sankalp Wish Award for Health, Water and Sanitation, Sankalp Alliance Award for Innovation and Clean Cooking Solutions, Sankalp Diffit Recognition for Women Empowerment, People's Choice Award and finally the Sankalp Artha Grand Prize. The summit saw keynotes by esteemed personalities who shared their insights. So um, I think you can expect to see very significant flows of capital coming to countries like India. They inspired and encouraged the audience. I don't think Singapore or US is going to be innovative in healthcare delivery. They don't have to be. There is abundance there. We as a country, we don't have those abundance. We are constrained. So here is a wonderful platform for all of us to be innovative, for all of us to bring some solutions which can not only change care for our own people, but can challenge the conventional beliefs of the developed nations. Across 28 knowledge sessions, panelists debated and challenged the status quo. The summit was a hotbed of innovations where reports and products were launched and mentoring connections were facilitated. Several initiatives and partnerships made this summit different and ensured that delegates make the most of their summit experience. Pre-summit workshops, structured networking sessions, wall of ideas and global marketplace made the summit truly inclusive. Delegates connected over special networking events that were hosted by Sankalp partners. The summit also saw a unique reverse pitch from corporates like Hindustan Unilever, Google, Bosch and Cisco who pitched to enterprises offering them support. The summit came to a close with the big wigs of financial inclusion debating the viability of business models that serve the financial needs of the poor. What we want is for you to have compassion for poorer people. And if you have compassion for poorer people, you will see that they are not pleased. But you must charge for the services. Sankal Forum's ongoing engagement in Africa fashioned a panel discussion focusing on Afro-Indo collaboration. The panel highlighted how the private sector had led forays into new regions and hence set an example for others to follow. So we are committed to taking the entire intellect ecosystem of intellect, capital and network to the African continent. After three days of high impact sessions, the curtains came down on Sankalp Unconvention Summit 2014. The summit was a culmination of ideas and aspires to return bigger and better. Join us for the Sankalp Africa Summit and Sankalp Unconvention Summit in 2015.